All right, guys, welcome back to more Let's Play Harry Potter uh, 2, The Chamber of Secrets. We are... You won last time we raced. Think you can win again? Yeah. It'll cost five beans. I could win again. So we are... Um... Ooh, okay, so it's a slightly different race with this guy now. Uh, we're doing some broomstick racing. We also have a gnome toss that we can do. So we have we've finished the game. We're just doing like cleanup now. Oh. All right, I see where the race is sending me now. <gasps> no. Oh, I lost it. Ooh. I thought it was turning earlier than it was that first time. Luck, you might win next time. All right, we'll allow ourselves to go down to 50 beans at most. Come on, Harry. Let's race. You might even win this time. It'll cost five beans. Yeah, I accept. Okay, so we have 60. So we can do three more races. I don't know what that guy's doing. There we go. So we won that one. This time, Potter, here's a famous witches and wizards card. Nice. Uh, Aldebert Waffling, 1899 to 1981, famous mag magicianal theorist, theoretician, or whatever. I'm confident I'll beat you this time, Harry. Let's have another race. It'll cost five beans. Okay. Where is it? Oh, wow. That was a little unfair in terms of like the starting and how they're making you turn and stuff, I guess, but. I won, <laughs> even though I crashed. You won well, Potter. Have this wizard card. I'll take a wizard card. Nice. Okay, so each race is three, it seems. So we'll... Uh, how many... We're at, what, 86? This would be 87... Also, what was the wizard card we got? Perpetua Fancourt, 1900 to 1991, which who invented the Lunoscope. Try again, Potter. This time you might break the known throwing record. It'll cost 50 beans. <laughs> All right, mister. That's not nice. Oh, good. Okay. No, no, no. I still have this one to throw. Shouldn't count as a miss. That one does. Ow. Seriously? Oh, that was off. Nope, you only get three total score throws. That's a shame. Card for you, 
Potter. You didn't beat the record. I don't know. Uh, that's a lot of grinding we would have to do. A lot of grinding to maybe get it done. So let, let's look here. We are at how many? Doesn't tell me how many. 86. So there are 15 wizard cards left. One of which is tied behind gnome throwing. Um... I can't, I can't cast my spell for some reason. I can't cast spells, so I'm going to go inside. I can fly, but I can't cast spells. Um, okay, so one of the wizard cards is tied behind gnome throwing. Which then makes me think there are four levels worth of races uh, still to do. Each would give three so that's 12 plus the one from gnome throwing is 13 which would put us to 99 out of 101 um jeez and you know that's under the assumption that i'd be able to actually get everything uh I'm not even sure I'd be able to know where everything would be in terms of wizard cards. I can make educated guesses. Um, but, I mean, we theoretically could have missed a wizard card on the Weasley Farm. We could have missed a wizard card in the Forbidden Forest when we crashed there with the car. Um... And there may be something that I think that I had done that I didn't do. Um, although, granted, I'm pretty sure we have every chest open. I know I could probably just do something as simple as um, pulling up a chest location guide and then just... Um, Going to each area that it describes, and then just checking. Which, uh, I don't know if I'm gonna do that, though. Like, there, I don't believe that there's a reward for getting every wizard card. Um, obviously, you get the health rewards as you get wizard cards uh, throughout the game. Um... But getting all 101, I don't think unlocks anything. Oh god, that's 18. So we could at least try and find the next racer. And attempt one race. Anyway, what's down there? Oh, that's just a, uh, a darker spot on the grass. Never mind. Ooh, okay, so there's this person. Fancy a race, Harry? It'll cost ten beans. All right, so we'll race. Oh, geez. Doesn't help that we're flying towards the sun there. All right. So that's another wizard card. You won this time, Potter. Here's a famous witches and wizards card. Okay. Puts us to 87. 
Uh, Almeric Sawbridge, 1602 to 1699, famous for conquering the river troll that was terrorizing those trying to cross the Y River. River troll in question believed to be one of the largest ever to exist in Britain with a weight of one ton. All right. Well, I don't have enough beans. Thank you. So I'll fly over here. If we can get two more beans. There we go. So now we can at least do another race. Thank you. You won last time we raced. Think you can win again? It'll cost 10 beans. All right. <laughs> nice broomstick race. Jesus. Over the lake. I see the direction the rings are taking us. All right, we got it. That was a very close race, though. Well done for winning, Harry. Have a wizard card. Okay, so we've we've done a collection of some wizard cards here now. Um, now we're at 88. Uh, Maribella Plunkett, 1839 to Unknown, famous for falling in love with the merman in Loch Lor uh, Lamond. While on holiday, while her parents forbade her from marrying him, she transfigured herself into a haddock and was never seen again. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, so, um, we have gnome tossing, we have racing that we could do, um, so, if this is the final episode of the LP, don't be surprised, uh, as it would just end up being, you know, more wizard card stuff that we would get, in which I don't believe that the wizard cards changed at all from, um, year one to year two. Uh, I don't believe that that ended up being a thing. Um, if there's going to be more uh, videos for um, this sort of collection, I will have done research as well to figure out where these supposed last two wizard cards are. Because we have, if we think about the math here, um, which I did the math earlier, but if we think about it. So we get one wizard card for um, the gnome tossing. We'll get one wizard card uh, for this next race that we're doing, which will put us to 90. And then each race seems to be a set of three. So if we assume there are three more races, then that will end up being... Uh, 99 which means there are two wizard cards left um and so those could be in a chest that i forgot to unlock uh they could be back at the beginning of the game where um they're at either uh the whomping willow area which we might have access to and i'll figure out if we do or not uh or um the weasleys 
And so if it's at the Weasleys, well, I can't really do anything about that now. There's, I guess there's no access. I could have swore that you could come b go back to the Weasleys, but I guess not. And that just went into the wall. Thanks. Um, so I'll have an idea as to where the quote-unquote missing two are and if they really are missing. Um, because then I will know exactly as to what we would need, uh, to do for the wizard cards, which it looks like I have enough beans to do the last race with this guy. So let's do that in which then that'll end this video. And whether or not there are videos after this um, will depend on my mood and the grinding of beans and all of that. So, I'm confident I'll beat you this time, Harry. Let's have another race. It'll cost ten beans. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, Jesus. Okay. No! We were close, though. We were close. Bad luck, Harry. Better luck next time. All right. So when we come back, uh, possibly grinding for wizard cards. Uh, and if not grinding for wizard cards, then uh, a new LP. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you then.